Okay, guys. So basically, from last time we were, he I was here on episode four. I was supposed to turn this in, so that's what I'm doing now, turning this quest oh, in. Let's see how this looks like. I can't remember. I think this colors well, chest piece, but yeah, whatever. I don't really like any. I didn't really like this. So, anyways, that quest is done. I'm gonna talk to this guy again. Yeah, talk to. So I'm supposed to go back to Morlad. So going back to Morlad, how far is that? That's far away, so I'm actually going to get off this horse and use my war band. I mean, my war steed. Pop it up! Okay, running there. Boom, boom, boom. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. So this is my war steed, super fast. Oh, I forgot to put my speed buff on right there. And I think that speed buff is actually only on yellow lion. Let me look. Shift M. Yep, right there. It's called Dash, and it's from yellow lion. That's only re one I actually get from yellow lion is Dash, because that's... yeah. Sorry, but I think the worsty, the only thing they're good for is to make your horse look pretty other than that. I think it was a waste of work for them to do. And then there's not really much, um, lamb, whatever. I just think it was a bad idea, but whatever. They wanted it to be horse lords and blah blah blah. I remember horse lord farming. I'm pretty sure some of you guys remember that. People farmed that. And blah blah blah. So, anyways, here I am at back to Morlad. Mm -hmm. Getting off the horse and turning this in. Where is the turn in? Turn. Oh, here it is. Gondor needs your aid. Gondor needs your aid. Oh, this is a instance quest. Oh well, session, not session play. I hate, I hate, hate, hate session play. By news of the Oathbreaker's influence on the Vale and the growing threat in Tarlang's crown, Malthalam has called you and Lady Rushfield to council. Gondor. Come, Paul, new Joe. Hey, this lady was the one on top of the hill before. From what I remember, this whole Gondor thing is really all about women. I mean, the the, the it's all about the leaders or the town queen or whatever. It's women, women, women. Started since actually, um, Eowyn in that land of um Rohan. I stood as a member of this heritage and blah blah blah, but now it's a thought it's only as a symbol of oath broken. I think they're talking about the um I don't know what they're talking about actually. It, it seems like they're talking about the people that um Look at this bed, oh my god. See, you know, in our houses, we can't even put our shelves this close to each other. Lamo. They never fixed housing ever. They'll never update it ever. You spoke of a worrisome thing, Candy Boo? Yeah, I did. Not this game. I think it's time you share them with us. Now I'm supposed to tell a story to, um, Rustin or this guy, so slash story or I could actually just click this right yep yep I can so cute let me back up the other thing that makes me uh, miss Lotro sometimes when obviously when I'm not playing look at this face super duper duper cute Aww. fat cheeks so Oh, I'm supposed to talk to, again, to this guy, Malcolm. Oh, there we go. Preposterous! He cannot be Isildur's heir, so the dead would never obey him. Then perhaps he seeks to deceive them. In their cowardice, they betray the Dark Lord of blah blah blah, Dark Lord! 
you guys know who Dark that sounds like, right? From what other movie that I love, which I don't have an MMO. Harry Potter! So these two are still bubbling, wow. And they want me to go eastward, which is where I want to go, because the book is over there as well. Oh my god, this is so much blah blah blahing. Duff, I'm just gonna recite what they're talking about. To fight a war on two fronts shall only bring us to ruin! You speak true! It is decided then, if we are to survive, we must secure Landcarth and Tingle Bell. Endeavor to learn more of this man while you are there. For I fear he shall not tarry in the Vale should he succeed in rallying the dead. Well, that's done. So talk to this guy. Gondor needs your aid. Finish and travel now. Gondor needs your aid. Yes, Gondor needs your aid. You know what? I actually like reciting all these things and imitating and trying to talk like how they talk. So this is done. I know all this necklace is crap. I'm gonna click finish now. So this quest takes me to the next town of this place. That's not really quite. Let me check where the book is over there. Oh, the book is. No, that's not it. Okay, the book is still further away. So we're not gonna do the book right now. We are still gonna do loss for loss. Ba ba ba. So here we go, my horsey. Let's do a first person view on the horse riding. Am I going the right way? I don't know. I will press 12 back. Okay, so I'm not. Oh, okay, cool. I'm going the right way. I just need to go further. Oh, my buff speed. I still. Ha I don't think I actually have that cloak for I'm in their ab not in their absence. The descendants deed the server because I just couldn't do. I'm probably gonna continue doing that, but not well if I don't. I did do some of it, but the quests are always the same. It's either go to Lone Lands, pretend to be a horse, go to North Dance, pretend to be a horse, go to the Weather Top, pretend to be a horse. So you do that like for a hundred times. So here I am in this um, little town of Landcraft. And we are going to talk to this guy. Gondor needs your aid. Yep. Always the same, Gondor needs my aid. Which I know I've already said several times, but... Yeah. Yes, someone over there already said it. Yes, I know, someone told me that already too. Jeez. Like, I don't know or something. So I'm accepting all these quests. Two quests from this guy, and then I'm actually now gonna empty out my bag. And let's see what crap I have to sell here. I have lots of junk, and apparently there's nothing new here but the top and necklace. So I'm gonna get rid of that. Mm -mm -mm. Where is the necklace? Here it is. So I apparently have then big battle because all these jewelry are big battle jewelry. They're just not gold version. I'm gonna do some repairs. And there we go. So I am actually now going to park myself somewhere safe towards the hill up on the bowling ball hill, which is that way. So I'm gonna try to get over there as quickly as I can. I love the um, visual effects it does when you press the speed buff. I don't think I've seen any other game. I don't do this ring right there because that's just an interlude, which is 
don't you don't need I personally don't feel like I need to do that so I'm not so other than the dead nothing seems to be a uh, disturb so here I am at stone of erect now I'm getting off the horse and I'm supposed to do something here the stone of erect stands untouched but you know this here's footprints nearby no I don't where is the f curious footprints pressing the delete key oh that was it what was that I was just a scout I guess so. So going back to um to that town I was at because I guess they just wanted me to observe observe that bowling ball. Oh poop. Ugh stupid tree. So going to back to town. Psh, broken leg time. Yep, knew it. I love doing those jumps so I think they're fun. The person who can survive those, I mean not survive, but I have a no broken leg. It's a burglar. So I finished that quest already and I'm gonna stop here for now. So guys, thanks for watching this uh, episode of um, my series of Candy Boo Back to Land Droval. And thanks for watching guys. Leave a comment, leave a question, subscribe, share, blah blah blah. Take care guys, see you next time.